What's up, YouTube? So, uh, oh, it is a hot one today. My 38th birthday. Figured I'd come out, took the Thomas out for a spin. So I got warning lights now or LED on the passenger side. No, by the way, everything's going good COVID-wise. Um, haven't gotten it, knock on wood. And uh, I've been fortunate that I've been able to keep my job, so. But me and my father-in-law came out here last weekend, and um, so I didn't quite, this just didn't look as good to me as the old shifter did, even though that's the newer style that everybody knows and loves in the 90s models. The old Quadrostat just looks better. So I put the Quadrostat back in. It looks a lot better. Uh, it just, you know, it's, a, it's got the longer shaft. It looks like, you know, like it should. So, but, so we did that. And uh, I did, me and my father-in-law did the, uh, so I originally, if you remember, I just had the first two seats here red. So now the next three rows are red. Um, I replaced the seat foams. And any of these that didn't have uh, the good back foams that I hadn't changed out. So they all have new seat foams. The funny thing was this one here had some two spots on it like it had been bleached or something. Like somebody dropped bleach on it and they're gone. So I don't know what it was but I'm happy that they're gone and it looks good. Um, this seat back cover here, if you notice the lines don't follow the curve like this one does, this seat back cover is actually a high back cover. So I may save it for like the back seat or something. Um, I have one more seat back cover in the Thomas and two more bottom cushion covers. But anyway, there's your... Now I do apologize that they're kind of floppy and not pulled tight. I left my staple gun at home when we came out to put these on. So they're just sitting here uh, loose. So they'll get stapled soon, I promise. But, uh, and I still got to, you know, afterwards come in here and just clean, big time clean. So anyway, that's it. Thanks for watching guys and uh, stay safe out there.